Woke up this morning, Riley came downstairs, and within 15 minutes she said, Are you coming out by the fire? And I said, What fire? She said, The fire I made. Look at that. Bacon already? Yeah. Right. It did too. Because we got a little bit of time today. So maybe we'll go check out the camper. That's sometime after 3 o'clock. And I don't know, maybe maybe today's not a good day to go to the property because it's going to rain today too. Okay, why don't we go to the museum then? We might be able to go to the museum. The Fairbanks Museum? Yeah, along with the big chapters. Yep. Alright, maybe we will. Clean up breakfast, get a shower, get dressed, and then hit the road. Okay. And then we'll go check out that camper today. Check it out again. All right. A little bright out here. That ah, looks a lot better now. Dana and Riley are inside making lunch right now. Say hi. Hi. And eat some lunch and head out to go see the camper in St. Johnsbury. Hopefully it'll be in good enough shape that we can renovate it over the summer. We gotta figure out a few solutions for the water and the gray water system and the septic. I think we're probably gonna do a composting toilet so we can avoid septic, but the gray water, we're gonna to have to come up with a solution for, and definitely the water. We get a long road ahead of us. Before we do that, we got to even see if this camper's worth it. So let's go get some lunch and then head out. There's my little girl. Thank you. Why chips? Uh, I'm good. That'll be good. Thank you very much. Where you go? Check this camper out. Sure. Yeah. 
We just got back from St. Johnsbury and we went to look at that camper and there's going to be a change of plans. The camper is not repairable. It needs to be taken all the way down to the frame, which isn't that big of a deal now because he wants to get rid of it so bad that he's giving it to us for free. So tomorrow we're going to wake up, we're going to go over to the property and I'm going to cut some planks to put down on the ground so when we back the trailer up on it, the trailer doesn't sink in the ground over the next few weeks while we're waiting to come back up here and start working on the property and the trailer. The plan is we're going to take the trailer all the way down to the frame, take the walls off, the roof, all the flooring, and then we're going to stud out the flooring, the walls, and the roof, and we're going to turn it into a tiny house. How's that sound, Riley? Good. We can build you a little loft like you want? Yeah. All right, you excited? Yeah. Is it dinner time? Uh-huh. All right, I'm coming in. Take a ride to the property and cut those planks from the camper floor. Goodbye. All right. Love you. Right. Love you. Bye. Let me get the keys. And the oranges. Took it. Good to go. All right, we'll be back. All right. Thank you. Took 10 minutes. Wow, they just did this road. It's a moose. It's a baby moose, Riley. Yeah, that's hey, a baby go, go, moose. Go, 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 go. It's okay. No, that wasn't a bear. I think that, that was, was a baby a, moose. It was a baby moose. Wow. I seen the big guy. Uh, Years on them. Yeah, to see the baby moose. That was awesome. Look at that. So we're gonna have to postpone until tomorrow because we lost daylight and I'm out of bar oil. And I need to sharpen the chain. So that's the end of that for tonight. Daddy, a hug and kiss goodnight. Mm -hmm.
Oh, I love you so much. Oh. In about an hour and a half, two hours, hmm. I'll be able to sleep. Your best. Your I hope that is my plan. All right. Good night, baby girl. Cuddle with your Azzy. I miss Azzy. You want the light on or off? Uh, yeah, I don't okay. know what we need. Huh? I'll probably pick that down a little bit.